Our next stop in Panama is the stunning chain of islands on the border of Costa Rica called Boca del Toro, meaning the mouths of the bull. Bring your flip-flops and a sense of adventure. On the boat ride from the airstrip across the bay to our villa at Red Frog Beach, it dawns on us that we're about to be off the grid. You're surrounded by unspoiled beauty and biodiversity. It's as if nature is conspiring to unplug you and force you to completely slow down. Keep an eye out for the locals. First, there are the tiny red frogs. Then there are the sloths that spend most of their lives slowly, very slowly, munching their way through life. You feel your stress melt away when you're watching them. They may look adorably out of shape, but they're adept at staying in the trees, so even though we're right under them, we're not really in danger of getting 50 pounds of sloth in the face. Then there's the sea life. Boca del Toro's water is perfect for snorkeling. The water's really shallow, all in between the islands, and there's lots of starfish, coral, all kinds of other sea life. Starfish, 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 starfish. Oh my gosh, starfish, starfish! I have a thing for starfish. Can you tell? Then we pulled up to find quite possibly the freshest seafood this side of the equator. Make sure you order the lobster. It's definitely fresh. Served best with a cold Panama beer. Then it's time to take a peek below. Get your snorkel gear on and hit the water. Not a bad way to end the afternoon with a walk around the neighborhood. Now let's get up in the jungle. Last day in Boca del Toro and we are taking to the trees to zip line. Into the tree canopy of the jungle. The adventures in Boca del Toro are many and not for the faint of heart. I couldn't bring myself to wander the bat caves in waist deep water, but zip lining is a rush as you speed through the jungle, climbing into the canopy on breathtakingly high platforms. We let the kids go first. And that's a wrap for our Houston crew. Boca del Toro leaves its mark on you in a laid back, primitive way. It's mother nature's lesson to slow down, stop, and take a swim in wild and wonderful Panama. For our complete itinerary, go to welltraveltexan.com and click on Travel Stories.